pistols, there's beer cans, but most importantly, there's a lot of incredible live music that we're going to be playing throughout the day. And also, at our big day in as well, 7th and 8th, Mr. Jimmy, there's going to be a bonanza of live music. It is, it is. I'm, I'm being shot at right now, which is a bit of a bonanza. It reminded me of that, but um, yeah, it's just been an absolutely wild day, but it's uh, back to you, Chubba. Uh, I believe you're interviewing Apex Twin. Jeff Tron here with you broadcasting live from the Sydney Big Day Out Day 1. Make sure you tune in tomorrow again from 4 as we bring you Day 2 of the Sydney Big Day Out and Monday as we broadcast live from Melbourne. And if you're in Adelaide and Perth, make sure you get along and check it out. Our website has all the details about everything, except on this man. His name is Luke Vibert. And uh, you, what is going on, Am Luke? Am I a mystery? I don't know. You well. are the mystery man. <laughs> you're performing with Aphex Tin, uh, Twin on this tour? Yeah, and uh, we're old school friends, so it's good fun for us. But, yeah, I suppose we're not as well known as lots of the people here but if you're into electronic music then you probably know electronic dancey stuff i've heard of it the electronic <laughs> style music we actually played a uh, an apex uh, twin clip the other night i think it was probably uh, window liquor, window liquor or, yeah with the very long it's limousine a great video. completely out there and he seems to have an obsession with putting his head his own head on everyone's thing is yeah. that something you do have you have you got music videos that you've made yeah but yeah they're all none of them feature my visage at all and just uh, animation, nice little animations, because that's what I like. Animations? I should, yeah. I'm going to have to look out for them. I'm a big fan of animations. Cool. A little bit of a mix-up there. I've become obsessed with The Office <laughs> recently, so I'm sorry about that. Oh, oh, that's great. It's a good thing to be obsessed with. <laughs> Ridiculous show. Have you, have you yourself been to Australia before? Yeah, this is only my second time, but my sister lives in Melbourne, so I went out to see her and stayed a few weeks okay. last year. You didn't stay for six months like most British Oh, I wish I people. could, but yeah, I've got little kiddies at home. So have you? How to, many? Couldn't take them, only two. How old are they? One and three. Oh, my God. Yeah, man. And how's your missus coping with you away on the she holiday of a lifetime? <laughs> she loves me getting away. Yeah, I can imagine. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why, but she always says, go on, get out. So... So you're actually, you're on separate to Apex Twin or you're, you're part of together, his show? Yeah, we've managed to sync our computers together, which took loads of work, especially because one's a Macintosh and one's a PC. I would have thought uh, that would be pretty much impossible to get yeah, them working know, together. They do now, it's great. Last couple of shows, the one at the Gold Coast was really good, so I'm looking forward to today. Got about an hour before we have to play, so it's starting to get excited. Because he's been out here before, yeah? Yeah. And it's, from memory, he sits on a couch or a beanbag or something for the set. And he just kind of lounges around and press, presses the space bar. Yeah, he, he generally hides. Yeah. He gets, he gets all shy, so he hides. <laughs> Whereas the Chemical Brothers will come out and kind of make it look like they're doing all kinds of stuff. Whereas I'm sure they're probably just pressing the space just bar play, as well. Playing Space Invaders. Yeah. <laughs> what do you actually have to do as, you know, for your set? Do you just kind of turn it on and hit the start button? Oh, I know. It's constant work, really, all the time. <laughs> Honestly, much more than if I was just DJing. That's, really? Oh yeah, man. It's always. What kind of machines things. have you got there? Only two laptops, but two different programs on each one, and it's hard to sync them all together. We're constantly battling the computers that are trying to go out of time. So you've got different elements, like I'll play the drums through my computer, and he'll have some bass line going, then chords, and we'll kind of build tracks up, and then suddenly, wow. that suddenly the bass line starts drifting off, and we're like, oh my god, what's happening? So it's kind of a battle, really, with technology. What's happening behind us? Well, I hope the tiger <laughs> is being played. I'm, I'm, it's kind of quite confusing with that going on. So that's, that's, it does sound like Kraftwerk played here uh, last Ooh, year. and they yeah, had I wish the, I was here then. Well, they, just, they press space bar. Oh, really? So it's good to know there are some you know, electronic people out there that are actually working hard. Yeah. What, uh, what are you hoping to do while you're in Australia? You've... A bit of um, surfing, a bit of hanging out. Yeah, lots of beach, and it's great because it's freezing back in England at the moment, so it's the ultimate holiday really, to come out here, and it's all nice and warm. It's a good place to be indeed. Who are you keen to see on the big day out, Bill? Well, I've only seen acts in the dance tent. I've seen most of them now, Basement Jacks, and I've seen the Black Eyed Peas. They were great, but I haven't seen any of the rock bands, so oh, okay. still got to go and see them. I'd love to see the darkness. Can't wait. Yeah, I saw a little bit of them today. They were very special. Cool. I've, have you seen Peaches? Oh, yeah. I've actually played with her a few gigs before. Really? In, yeah, in Europe and in America. Wow. Yeah, she's great. She's uh, quite... Mad. See, there's someone that puts the CD on and then, you know, sings along to it. She did last time she toured. <laughs> Take her home to your mum. <laughs> yeah. This is because she, she vomited in the, uh, in the mosh pit. In the, uh, uh, at the Gold Coast Big over Day. Over the mosh pit. Yeah. Have you got anything planned like that for tonight's <laughs> show? Oh, just over my computer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to take a look at a, uh, an Aphex Twin song right now. Not one I'm familiar with, but I'm sure you at home will love it. 
as they say, it's not sexist or racist. It's called donkey rhubarb. And uh, Luke Vibert, thanks for talking to us. Have a great big day out. Thanks, nice. Luke Vibert, Apex twin right now.